Why me? Why my life? God have mercy on me. Oh, God. Oh. Ah. Good morning, everyone. And my name is Sammy J. And I welcome you to a day in my life at UW Madison as a mechanical engineer. Finals edition. It's currently finals week. It's almost Christmas time. Just got to push through these final days. So I'm going to show you what a day in my life looks like during finals. I will warn you, quite boring. But the first thing I do every morning is I wake up and I weigh myself because I'm currently kind of in a big weight loss grind. By the way, it is currently 8 o'clock in the morning. First thing I do is I run over here, grab my scale. Sorry about the camera quality in advance, by the way. I'll be getting a better camera for Christmas, so you won't have to worry about this for too long. I take my scale, I go and I weigh myself, I write my weight on this little board thing here, which has all my stuff going on. The next thing I do after I weigh myself is I get myself a cup of coffee to wake up, because I'm really tired when I wake up in the morning. very delicious. Now that I have made my coffee, I got a shower and then I go and I eat at Rita's Market because they have a buffet on breakfast. I'm on the ketogenic diet which means that I eat about 20 to 30 carbs per day and eggs are definitely my favorite food to not eat a lot of carbs because the breakfast buffet at Rita's from 7.30 to 9.30 has eggs. That's what I'm gonna go eat. All right, now I'm all showered up and ready to go. Here's my little workspace that I work at. It's actually my roommate's, but he is not here right now. He's actually at home already for winter break. I kind of use it as my little study area. Now I'm going to go eat breakfast and probably grind some studying for my mechanical engineering final that I have today. As I was about to walk out the door, I realized I left my coffee there while I took a shower. Now it's cold and tastes terrible. This is what the food looks like at Rita's. Bacon looks good, eggs look good. So, this is what the place looks like to eat in. So, now I'm gonna be leaving this place. I'm probably gonna go edit my vlog from yesterday because I still have to do that. Back to my dorm. If you're wondering what dorm I'm in, I'm in one called Humphrey. It's on Lakeshore, which is over by the lake. And it is a really awful dorm. It's tiny, it doesn't even have laundry. These rooms aren't terrible. They're pretty decent size, but they're just not nice at all. Like our heater doesn't even work. It's cold half the time in this room. Wind will literally seep under the window. I'll feel a nice giraffe while I'm sleeping. Another thing about these dorms that I really don't like is their placement. Lakeshore is kind of far away from everything else. Like I prefer to eat at Gordon's, which is over by Southeast. It's kind of annoying to have to bike there every time. Realistically, this is probably what my room looks like like at all times, unless I'm feeling super ambitious. Now, as you can see, I put my mattress on top of my futon because I was sick of sleeping on my futon because it has this middle part right here that really hurts to sleep on. It like breaks my back as I'm sleeping. So I put my mattress up there so I can sleep a little better. I'll definitely be moving that back up there before I leave because it looks really ghetto. If you're wondering how much that cost me to get that buffet, it cost me $3.50. It's normally $7.25, but after you take $3.75 off because that's the discount we get on our Wiz cards, it costs $3.50. Much better. I'm currently waiting for my videos from yesterday to be put into my video editor that I use. If you're wondering what I use, it's called VideoPad Professional. I pay 15 bucks for every three months of it. It's only five bucks a month, it's actually pretty cheap. I'm just gonna start studying some chemistry. All of these pages that I've used so far, were all studying for finals. This is everything that I planned on doing for my math studying. And let's just say 
I didn't do like any of this. My plans for studying are always a lot more detailed and organized than I actually end up doing. If you want to go into mechanical engineering, little tip for you for the classes that you take because they're mostly math based. Don't worry a ton about the concepts, although get them the general idea down for them. But it's really just about doing as many problems as you can in those classes so you can get it down really, really well. Now that we're done with that, I got to study for Emmy because I have the exam at 2.45 and it is one o'clock, so hour and a half to study. Anybody watching this is planning on becoming a mechanical engineer. This is the kind of stuff that we have to do. Uh, it's not terribly hard, it's just a lot of playing with rates and derivatives and stuff like that. But it is kind of boring, I'd have to say. Like, I did not really enjoy this class. It's just a lot of labs that are really tedious and boring. If you don't enjoy tedious, boring stuff, I would not recommend becoming a mechanical engineer. It is 1.50, I just finished studying for my mechanical engineering final, and I am going to head on over there right now because it is in an hour, and I want to be there early. Pre-exam grind. Snack, how are you feeling about this uh, big mechanical engineering final? Really good. How about you, Colton? Peachy. It's exam time. How are you feeling about this big mechanical engineering final exam? I uh, kind of forgot about it a little bit. That's <laughs> stressful. That's solid. Too much of my capacity. How's the final exam feel, Colton? <laughs> not too bad. I'm not sure what the attitude that oscilloscope is supposed to look like. Connor, how'd the exam go? Uh, not bad. Some of them were confusing. <laughs> Got back to my dorm. It's currently quarter to five. I just brought my dinner home, some delicious almonds and some meat and some cheese. I didn't think the exam was terrible. I was expecting it to be a lot worse, but I also think that there's a couple things that I could have gotten wrong, which is fine. But I think it went just fine. So now I got to study for chem, which is Thursday. So I have two days for that. It really sucks because I just want to get out of here. Another thing I tend to do on a typical day in my life is especially during finals because I have so much time is get a lift in during the day I have not done that quite yet so I'm probably gonna do that later when there's less people there and I'll probably take a nap in between then and now because I'm really tired I just woke up from my nap it is 7 30 it's a decent nap it wasn't really what I was hoping for but I think it's late enough now that there won't be as many people at the natatorium. I decided to bust out this badger sweatshirt that my uncle bought me, but I never wear because it's about 80 sizes too big on me. Just finished up my lift, so now it is time to go and start studying my chemistry for Thursday. Almighty the Jope, the biggest dorm on Lakeshore. Seems we have a little wild food delivery guy rolling up on us. Yo, chill. Yeah, go around. Oh, oh, it's confused. Poor guy. Just got done showering after lifting. I'm probably not gonna do much more tonight. I'm probably just gonna go to sleep, honestly, because I kind of need to get some sleep to prepare for the final on Thursday. It is 9.15, so I kind of want to get that day lag of rest in and get a good night's sleep tonight so that I'm not tired for Thursday. Even though I'm pretty good about getting up in the morning, but 7.45 is gonna suck. Uh, can't, can't miss that. Hope you enjoyed the day in my life as a freshman here at UW-Madison, a mechanical engineer during finals week. If you wanna see what my grades are or like what I get on my final exams, drop a like on the video. Uh, if I get enough likes, maybe like, and then I'll make a video on that exposing what my exam scores and my overall scores are. Drop a like on the video if you did enjoy and subscribe if you are new here. I make videos fairly often. I'll be able to make videos a lot more often now that Christmas break is rolled around and uh, see you in the next one.